to living. I'm Pearl. Hi, Pearl. Hi, everybody. It's me, Pearl. Yes. Welcome, co-host. So today we are going to show you how we stretch. This is a series of you know uh, yoga movement mixed with just you know regular stretching. So I really don't have names for all the moves, but they are effective. And we do that at home because we haven't even been at the gym for so long, but you still yeah. have to exercise. Push the chairs away and do some exercise. And this is really moderate exercise that you can do at home with your children. So mom and dad, please join us. Ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is a series of exercise and I'm just going to show you how to do it. We start with deep breathing. We go up and then comes down on the side and breathe so again inhale going up and then when you're coming down that's when you exhale good job and you do that like three or four or five times again one more up and then come on the side good i like that posture pearl great and now we, it's important to open your, your lungs, right? Mm -hmm. Now we're going to lunge, go this way. Yes, and parallel to the ground, right? And we stay there. And so these stretching exercise, it's really about grounding yourself. You stay in a position and just kind of- Let's count like to 10 okay. on each side. Okay. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. And you come back. Transfer your weight. And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Job. So next exercise now, right? Mm -hmm. And then we're going to go up like this and lift up your toes up and you stay in that position counting ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. And guess what? If you get off balance, you just start all over. Yeah. So it's really about trying to do this. And this exercise not only helps you stretch, but it also strengthens your muscles. Okay? So okay, I think. Can I do one? Yes. So let's do child's pose. Okay. So go on knees. We'll go on our knees. Okay. Then go forward. Okay. Good. Then just stay there, right? Let's do um ten. Okay. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six Mississippi. Seven Mississippi, eight Mississippi, nine Mississippi, ten Mississippi. Good job. And you come back. And now that we are here, we're going to go to a downward dog pose. Okay? And still stand in the stretching position. We're going to go on four and then we'll and lift. when you're ready, yes, lift come up. up. Good. And One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. And here we're going to move into cobra pose. Straight there, you can do the modified 
and then we're going to count five and go back to the double dog. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Yes, you can put your knee down and you go back up. You have to feel yourself growing. And you can move your legs in the back so that you can make sure you breathe. Inhale and exhale and go back to Cobra Pose. We go back. Good. And we stay there for five. One, two, three, four, and okay, go up. up. You can do what you find coming down. Go to the down. Okay? Go up. Do you feel? Okay. We stay there. Like I said, you can move your legs in the back a little bit and stay there. Make sure you breathe. We're coming. And then we'll go back into Cobra Pose. Just take your time. Paul is going to do the modify. Good job. Good. And this is great. It really helps you strengthen those muscles. Good. I'm breathing a little bit. Okay. And then go back to down with that. I can really feel it in my arms. Yes. They're kind of aching. And now I'm moving to cover pose. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Good. Good. You stay there. Good. And straight. That's great. And now you come to your knee. And go to child pose and rest. Just yes. stay here for a few seconds. Yes. And you can move in. You can move sideways to stretch a little bit more. Great. And then, good job. And from here now, we're going to get one I can up. really feel it in my arms. They're yes. aching. Okay. From Hold yes. Okay. Left or right leg, that's great. You can stay there. And then just stretch. Stretch. Okay. Great. And you just stay there. This is also kind of a balance. Yes. And so you want to keep the knee a little bit spread. Yes. Exactly. And then you stay. And this is really a balance pose. And yes, that's okay. And remember, if you get out of position, you can go back and try it again. It's exercise. I Great. can really feel it. Yes, and then we'll back come here in the legs. Good, and we'll come back for that. Remember, we always walk both sides. And then again, you go lunge forward and just stay there. You can feel it in the back of your leg. That's a good stretch and just smile. You know, we're coming out of the holidays, so uh, we might not have a very good balance mm -hmm. after a lot of food, <laughs> but we want to get there, right? Mm -hmm. You want to be able to get back to your normal routine. So this might feel difficult, but guess what? All exercise in general feels difficult. And this one, just stretch. That's a good stretch. You know, a lot of times we forget to stretch our foot, right? Mm -hmm. And when you do that, you can feel the stretch right there in your foot. See? Mom and Dad, this is the place where sometimes you have arthritis. That's where you start feeling some achiness in your feet. So mm -hmm. this, your feet. yes, so this really helps. So I call this my Take care of yourself exercise where you're just trying to listen to your body and stretch. Okay guys, now we are going to start a series of, you know, balance exercise. You know, when we age, we try, we lose our balance. So we have to try to keep it. And I know you are developing, so you are trying to get your balance. So this is good for both of us, okay? So here, we're going to go up. And then you can pause before if you feel like you need to uh, put your foot down, okay? You can pause and move back. And you can also put your foot on the chair, 
and we count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. And you can try to do the same thing at home and this will really help you, okay? Now we're going on the opposite leg, okay? Again, we go up and then forward. Remember to pause if you feel like you need to pause. And then we go back. And it doesn't matter if you are falling. One, two, two three, four, and five. Good job. And you rest and you can do this two series or three series, really depends. Some days I have more energies than others. Okay? So let's do it again. Same, go up and then forward. Come back and we'll go back and open your leg. Open your arms, it helps you stabilize. One. One two, yes. three, four, four, and five. five. Good job. Good. And then breathe, right? Mm -hmm. Next. Go up and forward. Nice. Take your time. This is home exercise. No rush. No judgment. Just do your best. One, we're falling. <laughs> That's good. Two, three, four, five. Good job. And this is how you build that resistance. This is how you get it strong. Yeah. Okay, great. So, still staying in the balance series, we're going to do something that will be easier for you because you can actually use your hand to hold your knee, okay? Mm -hmm. So we're going to straight. I really like to do this because it helps me, like I Get said. Get a little bit of space in between your feet. Yes, and then lift up your right leg up and open it. See, good job. And this is not just balance, but it also helps you open, you know, your waist, really. Good, and I try to stay there. You can put your hand to hold it. One, two, three, four, five. Good job, good job. I like your perseverance. You have to keep doing it, okay? Mm -hmm. Great, so we're moving on the other side. And then we open. One, two, three, four, Five. I fell off. <laughs> Let's do it again. That was fun. Okay. And usually I try to focus on one thing. One, two, three, four, five. Good job. Great. Now shake your leg. And guys, this is great. You feel it, right? Are you feeling it? Yeah. Good. So Next series of exercise, this time we're doing some triangle. So this is going to be fun. So let's open it first. And then we're going to lunge on one side. Yes, you count to five. One, two, two three, three, four, four five. five. We come back in the middle. And then we're going on the other side. One, two, two three, four, five, and we'll come back to pause. Great, and we'll breathe. Good job. Now we're going to go do the same thing, but this time you can use the block to help you modify, okay? Mm -hmm. Because we're going to stay in that position. Again. And you can put it like that, or maybe raise it up a little bit. Yes. There, it adds length. So, open. And then we're going to move on this side since you have the block on that side. Yes. And I'm going to put my arm here. Like I said, this is a triangle move in yoga. So, we are doing a mix of yoga and just some regular stretching. Guys, always good to do what you can at your level. Mm -hmm. Always try not to do 
you know, something that would hurt you. So count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Great. We're gonna come back. Nice. And we always try to work both sides of our body. So oh you didn't even need it, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, you go back, launch on opposite leg, and put your hand there. And feel the stretch. Feel the stretch in your oblique. Feel it stretching here. Yes. Four, three, four, and five. Good job. And come up nicely. Always try to take your time and breathe. Great. So this time it's gonna be a little bit more difficult because we're going to need that. Okay. So this time we're going lunge one side and then come down. You can touch the block, raise it, yes, and then bring this arm and go up. And now look at the sky. Great. One, two, three, four, five. Gently come down and then breathe and we're going to go on the other side great isn't that too far from you okay again launch on your left great and put your hand down if you can and nicely go up take your time this is a stretching exercise so you really don't rush it okay one, two, three, four, five. Good. And come up nicely. You always want to make sure no jerky. No jerky. Mm -hmm. Great. Okay. Good job. Good job. And so when we come back, we're going to do a series of floor exercises. Okay, guys. Now we're going to move on to some floor exercises. We have our mat already and so first we are going to have our feet yes out like this up and a little bit yes and then we're we going to, to stretch. stretch try to reach stretch your back yes so we're going to do it for uh five seconds okay Good job. And now we're going to stretch by crisscrossing. Okay. So get your hand and reach on the side. No crisscross, remember? Yes, and then the this arm goes in your back. So we're stretching and twisting, but gently so that you feel the stretch in your back. You feel the stretch right there. Good. Nice. And now come back. And then we'll do it on the other side. Take a deep breath. And then extend and bring the arm in the back. Do that arm in the back and stretch. Stay in that position. Come to five. One, two, three. Good. Gently come back. Take a deep breath. Good job. And next exercise we're going to do a little twist. Just bring your right leg on the other side and then you can hold it with your left hand. Great. And then you're going to go on your opposite side and then turn and stay there. One, two, three, four, five. And we do it the same. On the other side, we always try to walk both sides of our body. And we stay there. One, two, three, four, five. Great. And you really feel the stretch. And sometimes I can do like this and repeat two or three times depending. Okay, and when we come back, we're going to 
play that. Okay. Okay for the next. Okay guys, this is our last section and we are going to lay down. We have cushion. You always want to make sure that you can use this cushion in case you have back pain, which I have lower back pain, so this helps support my back. And we're going to lay down. And when we lay down comfortably, yes, find the position that is comfortable for you. I need to stretch a little bit, move a little bit because of the chair behind me. This is better. And then we're going to stretch all the way. As we stretch our arm, we have to squeeze our legs. Squeeze, squeeze, and count for five seconds. And you can close your eyes and really feel the squeeze. And press your shoulder on the floor. This is great. One, two, three, four, five, and release. <sighs> this is a good stretch. And it helps you work your lower back, but also the lower part of your abs. Okay, as much as your legs too, right? Okay, again, let's do it again. We go up. Open your lungs, breathe, stretch your leg, and squeeze, press your shoulder on the floor, five, good, I can stay in this position for a few seconds, can we do that, by just breathing, just listen to your breathing. Just feel your heart and your chest going up and down. In yoga, we call this calves pose. So, no pressure, just breathe. exercise because it's really just stretching and trying to listen to your body and you know if you feel like there's a little bit of pain somewhere just you know try to be gentle and relax but very important exercise stretching whether you call it stretching yoga or whatever you want to call it mm -hmm. but do these exercises just you like can even call it meditation Yes, and of course, you have to include meditation in your exercise daily. It just helps you focus, be present, but more importantly, it helps you uh, have stress a, and de stress relax. and relax. Thank you. So, we're going to continue doing this exercise because this is really what we do at home. This is real people, real exercise for family, kids, mom dad you can join us next time and so um yes we're going to have more coming and don't forget to check out our other exercise we do have some already posted on our youtube and channel we are planning to make a exercise playlist so make sure to check that out soon yes and thank you for watching and visit our website envisionhope.com and if you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and share, and click that notification bell down below so you know when we post new videos every single time. Yes, thank you, co-host.